right, uh, sorry. <laughs> Awkward, ready? Hi, my name is uh, Staff Sergeant Elizabeth Ewell of the 143rd Security Forces Squadron. I was in the Air Reserve from 2005 to 2011 um, as services. Um, I got out for six years and decided to come back and I ended up in Rhode Island. And I've wa always wanted security forces, so that's how I ended up at the 143rd. Security forces is um, base security, flight line security, and a law enforcement aspect as well. I'm part of the CADM shop, which is combat arms training and maintenance. We train base populace on the weapon systems. We also maintain them. My kids are still young, but um, they know the differences between the uniforms. Like, Bo's in the military, Bo's going to drill. They know that. But for me, it's, I think, the same thing that my parents taught me. Be of service to your community. You know, my son has taken a huge interest in, like, you know, anything Army or any type of plane. Um, and as he gets older, I think I want to instill the importance of being, you know, patriotic and serving your country regardless of anything. It's going to be a huge thing. And the importance of, of joining the Air Force instead of Army. <laughs> yes, that too. <laughs> Just kidding, Army. You know we love you. I feel like the culture's changed as far as, you know, leadership, the people around you really do care about you and they, they want you to do well. Um, they try to help you out at the best you can. Obviously, you know, when I was in originally, you know, I was still living under Don't Ask, Don't Tell. So I didn't really get to form the relationships with my peers that I do now. Um, it's kind of like, oh, I'm seeing you one week in a month, but you can't have any idea what I do in my private life, which I think hurts overall unit morale and unity, cohesiveness. Um, I feel that's much different now. Um, you know, everybody knows that I'm, you know, married. I have two kids. They include her, you know, looked out for her when I was deployed, that kind of thing. So that's the biggest difference. And I think it's, you know, the best change I could hope for between 2005 and now.